Hey y'all! Another episode of Clark Smith Adventures. This is your host, Amy Cinnamon Clark Smith. We are in the town of Bedford, Pennsylvania. Bedford. Hope everybody is doing all right today. I am doing fabulous. I mean, you know, the best I can do, really. This is an adorable town. It's an old town. Used to be a diner. We used to go to here as a, as kids, and we loved it for some ungodly known reason. I think it was called like the Bedford Diner. It's a donkey. So they're like apartment buildings. Oh, it's an inn, sorry. It's an inn. Cute church. Why is this light so long? Oh my god. This is gorgeous. Um, all right, do you have a stop sign? I don't know. Typical 
small town Americana. Americana. Look at this building. Holy shit, look at that. It's a house, I think. It looks like apartments, businesses. pretty awesome I love these small towns. Let's go down like one of these streets. Oh, it's a school. This is a school. Anyway, I was saying before, there used to be a, um, just like little graveyards everywhere. It's weird. How would you like to live next to that? No thanks. As I was saying, um, you know, we used to have this diner. Why were, why were we pressed to go to this Rinky Dink Bedford. Oh, there's a library. Um, Bedford, Pennsylvania Diner. And the food was just like not even that great. I mean, I was young. I'm talking six, five, six. And, uh, I used to get all. I always used to get the patty melt. I've been obsessed with patty melts ever since I was a child. There's a cop. These damn cops are around here. What were you been? Grocery store. I mean, I'm sure that that, you know, I'm definitely sure that diner, I think this was it. This was the diner. This was it. This was the diner. And of course it's closed. But we used to come here as children and it'd be like a big thing. Like it was like an exciting event. I'm like, why did we, why were we pressed? It was called, I think it was like Bedford Diner and then it was called Landmark Restaurant. I don't know. But it's no more.
it said Bedford. Okay, let's look at the Bedford Historic District. Okay, let's turn this way. Oh God, Jesus! Supposedly, this is where the Bedford Historic District is. This is the historic district, y'all. I mean, I guess these houses are like super old, but. It's pretty cool. Raven, would you calm down, please? I had a friend, she was from Venezuela, and I brought her up here many, many, many years ago. I mean, we were probably in high school. You know, I brought her up to my grandparents with me, and she's like, the question she asked, why are there so many trailers? <laughs> I was like, honey, because they're affordable. Because that's all people can afford, you know. <clears throat> I just will never forget that. She was just like, why are there so many mobile homes and trailers? And I'm like, well. Oh, that's another no outlet. Oh, well. As long as you guys don't care. Oh, this is pretty. reminds me of this place is Halloween. This is this would be a, like a perfect Christmas town or Halloween town or something. 
you know, where you would spend the holidays. likes the American flag. I love the American flag because I'm an American and I live in America. Honey, ain't nothing wrong with that. Sometimes people are like, well, you know, I like it, but I just don't like what it sometimes what it stands for. And I'm like, I, I understand that. I totally get that. But to each his own, everyone has their own, their own opinion, you know. This is really cute. It's cute. limit through here. Because I saw like four cops in this small ass little town. Four. Bet you some of these damn places are haunted. Well, that was my little tour. I hope you all enjoyed it very much. And I hope everyone has a very blessed weekend, Labor Day weekend. And on the next video, subscribe. Always remember to subscribe. Subscribe. And comment like share oh let me go 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 all right y'all love you Mwah. everyone have a wonderful afternoon